G'day everyone, Elvin Pile here from Adventuring Piles and today we are going to be having a bit of a look around at some nice places near Eagle Hawk Neck uh, It's in the same peninsula as where Port Arthur is in Tasmania So yeah, come along and check out a few nice little spots with us We're just coming here for a day trip It's only about an hour drive from our home in Hobart So yeah, we'll just have a quick look around and then head back Come on and let's go G'day everyone, I hope you're well. My name is Elvin Pyle, you're watching Adventuring Files. We are an Aussie family with young kids working and traveling our way around Australia in a seemingly endless but epic road trip. Welcome to our channel and thank you for clicking on this video. Hey guys, how's it going? That is the Tasman Arch behind us. It's quite nice, hey? And it's right on the side of the road. So you pull up, like we have. One of the kids asleep, so we're just having a quick look. And it's just right there. It's awesome. Incredible, eh? Now we're at the Devil's Kitchen. Look out! It's just amazing the power of the ocean over time and what can what it can do, hey? Probably can't get a real good look at it from here on the camera anyway, but uh, yeah, still pretty amazing. That's pretty cool. The blowhole right there, nice and close to the car park again. All these places here I seem to be really close to the car park, it's pretty cool. As you can see, the waterfall is not really happening today. It's a bit of a trickle, but hey, this place is so cool. Nice. There you go, guys. Like it? 
This is what this is what it takes to get some of our Instagram shots right here. <laughs> Up the place. Just like you. So guys, we are just walking down to the Tesla pavement in Tasmania. And you look at the bank, looks like it's freshly eroded. And there's so many shells in there. I'm just wondering if this could possibly be an old midden. I don't know if there are middens down here or not. But if you know, please let us know. I would love to know if this is just natural deposit of shells or if it's an old midden. Well, yeah, let us know. Hello guys, Tesla pavements in uh, Tasmania. Like I said before, it seems very familiar to us being from Harvey Bay. If you are familiar with Harvey Bay, you'll know that it looks a lot like the rocks that they have at Point Vernon and Gattaca's Bay. And if you're not familiar with Harvey Bay, then I suggest you get off your butt and go check it out because it is one of the best places in Australia. It may be biased because that's where we're from, but I reckon it is, so go check it out. But this is pretty cool. Everybody. So here we are today at Miriam Bay and it's a beautiful little place not far from where we were yesterday at uh, Tasman Peninsula. I uh, just came here this morning to have a bit of a look. It got a bit late yesterday for us and we're just having a bit of a look around before we head back this afternoon.
bloody 1500 k's in the car and we got some uh pin scrapping already on it <laughs> by the sounds of it it's all right hey that's what we got them for Yep, some good old pinstrapping back on the car again. <laughs> uh, brand new car, but who cares, eh? Four wheel drive, that's always that's why I buy them for. Wouldn't have given it a second thought in the old car. All right, so we are driving, we have driven down to the end of the little peninsula at Marion Bay. Uh, and then it's a two hour walk if you want to walk all the way to the tip of the peninsula and back to this car park. We're just going to go on the beach, have a bit of a muck around, see. See uh, how far we go. We're not going to go the whole walk. It's uh, a bit too much for the kids. But yeah, uh, we'll show you around a bit. That's that water, which is a bit nippy, but good looking gutter over there. <laughs> I was half tempted to run back to my car and grab a rod, but uh, I'll have to give it a miss. Won't be here for too long. I'm gonna go back and uh, have a good fire up the fire grill tonight and make a good meal of it. But it's a freaking awesome beach, man. We're so glad to be back and traveling again. So good. Lots of shells on this beach if you like beach farming for some cool shells. Obviously we don't take anything home, just have a look at it and and then leave it on the beach. Do you like our collection? Oh we got shells. Hi, we're standing here on Marion Bay on the beach here. We came down the the unsealed farm track, old farm track. Brought us to this beautiful beach, secluded beach, we've got it all to ourselves. We could spend the whole day here just beach combing. There's beautiful scallop shells, conch shells, fingernail shells. Looking at the waves crashing on the beach. Yeah, Boys I loved it. Yeah, we, might... <laughs> uh, we might get going now though, because that rain looks like it's going to come here. We saw lots of little, um, what's it? Paddy melon tracks on the beach and wombat poos, so it'd be an interesting place to come in the evening. We'll probably see some wildlife. I don't think the boys want to go. No. Let's just stay here. <laughs> yeah. This whole beach, and we cannot see anybody else as far as I can see. Not a sight of anybody else on this beach. Now, you don't get that very often. Thank you for taking your time to watch our video. If you got some enjoyment or value out of it, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe for future videos. We'll catch up on the next one.